And uh, Andy Hetzel is with us from Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan. He's the Vice President of Corporate Communications. Good morning to you. Good morning, Michael. You were at least right about the weather. At least it's warm outside, eh? <laughs> I hope this is an Indian summer because I'm counting on that in the middle of November, right? Well, you, you called it last week when I was on the phone with you, so I, I credit you with the 70-degree temperatures we're going to have today. <laughs> okay, let's have 80s uh, for Thanksgiving then. How about, well, I will because I'm going to be in Hawaii, but the rest <laughs> of us will have to tough it out. Yeah, well, I'll be toughing it out here in Michigan. Uh, open enrollment season, what, what does that mean and uh, what should we know about that? Well, traditionally, open enrollment is the time that uh, people uh, who work for larger employers or even small businesses, they take a look at the health benefit options that their employers are making available to them. Um, it's a time, uh, frankly, of confusion and great dread for a lot of people uh, where they have to sit down and um, assess how their plan has changed if they have one plan option or whether they want to switch plans if they have numerous options. And uh, health insurance is a very challenging thing for folks to understand, Michael Patrick, even for myself, you know, when I review my benefit options that Blue Cross puts in front of me. Um, and we want to be here uh, to provide information as a resource uh, for people. They can uh, always, the best step is to talk to your employer's HR, either their internal HR office or uh, the company that they use to talk to employees about benefit options. That's a, a good first step, and bring your uh, your spending uh, on health care that you've that you've had over the last year. So you can, if you have a, a financing arrangement such as an HRA or an HSA, uh, your benefits advisor can help you uh, put enough money into that to cover your expected expenses for the year. That's a way to save money in health care. Uh, so there's a lot of options right now for people. Uh, people are absorbing more of the cost. Uh, that's unfortunate, but that's the reality today, and it's important for them to review the options that are in front of them. And and that's part of the reason, I think, why uh, Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan has such an extensive website as well, because you answer, as I see, not only questions about individual health care or corporate health care, but also the health uh, care reform. We, you know, every time we open up the newspaper, listen to the news, we're hearing about that, especially in the election season, and sure. people have a lot of questions about it. Yeah, and uh, the plans that people are enrolling in now during open enrollment season, Michael, these are the first plans um, following implementation of a couple uh, reform initiatives that have, been, that have taken effect. Um, one is that preventive care services now um, are 100% covered. Uh, people shouldn't see uh, co-pays or cost sharings with preventive care services. Um, there are a couple other changes as they relate to children and their eligibility with pre-existing conditions, uh, the elimination of waiting periods, uh, so to speak. Um, and people can find more information uh, at Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan at bcbsm.com slash health reform. Uh, it's a really fantastic tool for people, the website that we've created. We've tried to make it as simple and easy to understand and easy to use as possible. Uh, and there's a lot of information about how health care reform is going to change um, how people receive health care benefits, what those benefits are going to provide and look like. Um, so we encourage your listeners to go to bcbsm.com slash health reform and check it out. For instance, if you have a young person that has an individual policy because they've uh, you know graduated from college, now under the new rules they can stay under the family plan, right? That's correct. Up until age 26, if they are dependent, if they can stay on their um, their parents or their grandparents or whoever the guardian is, their coverage, mm -hmm. um, up until age 26. And, and that's an option that families have now. Um, again, the, the young adult can also enroll in their own plan. Uh, it's a choice. Um, and Blue Cross has a lot of affordable options available for young adults. Um, and so you want to go out there and you want to explore all the options that are available to you and your family. Uh, and we've tried to do uh, as much as we can through bcbsm.com, uh, and bcbsm.com slash health reform to help people in Michigan better understand these changes. And, uh, and Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan doesn't necessarily take a position on health care reform. They just have the job of implementing it, right? Well, we've long supported changes, Michael, as yeah. you and I have spoken about in the past, um, common sense changes uh, that would level the playing field here in Michigan, especially requiring insurance companies to end the practice of rejecting people for preexisting conditions, uh, that's a change that Blue Cross has long supported because we haven't done that here in Michigan for 72 years. Um, we think that insurance companies should cover people. Uh, so there are aspects of health reform that, that we have supported for a long time, even prior to the debate that took place uh, this year and last year. Um, so, you know, we put this website out there for people to understand. Now that we've gotten over the politics and the policy making for, for at least for this year, 
Um, we put together this website at bcpsm.com slash health reform to help people understand how the changes that are in place now are going to impact them and their family. We appreciate that kind of access. Thank you very much. Thank you, Michael. Appreciate the time and have a good week. Enjoy the balmy temperatures. They're not going to be around long. Temperatures are going to dip back down into the 50s, I think, starting tomorrow.